This is Gary Atencio with CNTV, and today we're in Parker, Colorado. I'm here at Integrity Solutions. Since 2017, they have provided gutter cleaning, repair, and a whole lot more for the clients here in Parker and the surrounding areas. I'm here with Dylan, who is the owner. Let me ask you, Dylan, this is really a, a family begun business. It's something you took over. Um, share with me a little bit how, how you got involved in this and uh, decided this was a good company for you to serve the public. My dad started it in 2017 and I went out with him on a couple jobs and then we started doing townhomes and I realized I was good at it and I enjoyed it so I wanted to blow it up and that's what I'm doing. That's what you're doing. That is great. Let me ask you this. We live in Colorado, a state where the seasons change all the time, yet weather can cause some challenges for a lot of our homeowners just trying to keep up with things. Is that something you found out there as you, uh, as you picked up new clients? Yes, and uh, we work all season long, so it just really depends. I mean, let me ask you this. Obviously, the seasons can provide problems themselves. We're yes. talking about fall, winter, um, hail, snow, you name it. Is that something that kind of keeps people on their toes when it comes to upkeeping their home? Definitely. Um, it can cause damage and stuff that needs repaired. It can make gutters, gutters dirty, so definitely. One of the areas, obviously, your expertise is in gutter. Uh, let's talk a little bit about that. I mean, regardless of what type of gutter people have, the gutter is really designed to protect your home. I mean, it's designed to make sure the water's not coming off onto the foundation. Um, is this something that basically a lot of homeowners don't understand how important uh, it is to keep that clean? Correct. Yeah, maintenance on gutters is extremely important. People will let it go for years and years, and eventually it'll rust their gutters out or cause foundation issues and siding and soffit and other issues as well to their home. I think a lot of people realize how important a gutter is, and that's why they have them. But I don't think people realize that having a dirty one is kind of like not having one at all. I mean, this water, it basically can get clogged up. Um, what kind of damage have you seen that a lot of this water can, can provide? There's a lot of weight <clears throat> that can be in the gutters from your roof granules to other debris. Um, it'll literally pull the gutters away from your fascia. The spikes will come out of your fascia board and everything else like that on top of rust over time. Let me ask you this, Dylan. Obviously, your customers out there, they become your clients. These are people that you service pretty much year round. Um, when it comes to Colorado, and we're talking about leaves falling, snow, you name it, how often should a person get their gutters clean? Are we talking once is enough, or what do you recommend? At least once a year, if not twice. It really depends on how many trees and your property and all that stuff. As a customer out there, can they set those up for you? Will you just come out kind of on a on a schedule, if you will, and keep it clean for them. Definitely, and I have a database that I follow up with all my customers as well. When I'm looking at getting gutters clean, obviously I'm kind of a do-it-yourself kind of guy. I think I can get up there and do something, and then I realize how difficult it is. It's not too easy, and for some people, I imagine actually them getting up doing it themselves can be kind of dangerous. It's extremely dangerous. One uh, mistake, and it's life-threatening. Um, that's why we're fully insured and we're professional and we have plenty of experience doing every type of roof, every type of house, project, whatever you need done. So I imagine your two-story homes, uh, that's even a, a greater level of uh, danger, if you will. Um, is it just yourself that goes out there or do you actually have a team that can go out and help you as well? I have a crew. I have a four-man crew. Okay, a four-man crew. Let's talk a little bit about the stages of cleaning that gutter because honestly, I get up there and I'm you know, trying to do it with a rake or what have you. Tell me, walk me through your four step here on how uh, gutter cleaning happens for the professional. <clears throat> we get up there and we scrape them out by hand with a two inch putty knife and we scoop all the debris into a bucket or bag. We take a before, during and after pictures. We then proceed with a flush. We power flush all the gutters with a high pressure hose and nozzle to ensure proper water flow and drainage. This, al this also detects any leaks that you may have in your gutters. If you have any leaks, we seal them with gutter sealant. That's the correct way to clean gutters. Interesting. I imagine from the ground level down here looking up, there's a lot that the consumer can't even see. Correct. When you guys get up there, you probably find things from animal nests to uh, messed up roofs to maybe even some damage. Um, the inspection on the front end, is that something that you guys provide? And uh, does that actually cost the consumer for you to come out and see what you need? We do a complete free inspection and it's thorough. We look at everything when we get to the house. And like you said, you even provide some photos of, uh, if need be, showing them what you're able to see up there as well. Correct. Yep. 
That is interesting. Um, let me ask you this. Obviously, we said before, gutters is your specialty. Um, share with us also, I mean, obviously, the elements out there have a way of getting into our house. One of those areas is the chimney up there that a lot of people don't think about. Tell me how you're able to help people in that area. So if your chimney is cracking or breaking or has any voids or holes, we know how to resurface it with a polyurethane concrete. This allows it to breathe and move and withstand the elements over time, unlike regular brick and mortar. So that's how we fix that. What about somebody who has some brick and mortar and they need that brick and mortar repaired, or maybe they have some siding that needs repaired? Is this are these some of the services when I look at uh, correct? Yep, we cleaning do, and more. <laughs> we do brick and mortar, siding, fascia, soffit, stucco, power staining, gutters, roofing, I mean, snow removal. One of the things I try to get across for people out there is educating them on the idea that professionals, they have the experience, you have the tools that I don't have. I mean, I've, I've cleaned my house before with a hose, hose it off. Share with us how some of these tools are able to do it much more efficiently and a better job, even like that of uh, power cleaning, because I know that's something you do as well. Uh, no. Do you do power cleaning? We, we do, but it just pressure washer, like a high pressure washer. Oh, it's pressure washer? Uh -huh. Tell me about a pressure washer. People don't know what the heck a pressure washer is out there. What is that compared to a hose and me taking a hose up? It shoots at a, <laughs> a, a way higher pressure, um, usually like 40 to 50 miles per hour. Wow, so anything so as far as... So it can get all the dirt off and smooth it out and everything, and then you have to brush it and all that stuff. There's, Concrete there's an art to it, yep. Really interesting. Um, let me ask you this. Obviously, this is a company that... Um, you guys have built up for some time. You have many clients out there. Your reviews look great. Um, you really hold yourself to a higher standard of service. Is this something that you pride yourself on and basically you make sure that you're picking a crew that understands uh, the importance of taking care of someone's home? Exactly. It's all about integrity, doing the right thing. Everyone, no one's watching. We always go above and beyond. We always do the extra mile to get that extra satisfaction to let people know we're on top of our game. Webster's definition of integrity basically is the quality of being honest and having strong moral principles. Is it rewarding for you to basically take a company that was founded by your family and uh, continue offering that level of service? Yeah, it's extremely important and that's my main goal is to keep that as you blow service up the company, as I go. Like yeah. Mm -hmm. That is wonderful. Viewers, let's take a look at the bottom of the screen right there. What you're going to see is that a website. First of all, on the website, you're going to see all the different services they offer out there. Now, keep in mind their specialty is gutter cleaning, but they can repair those gutters as well. They can take care of uh, siding on the home for you. We're talking about even let you know if your roof needs some uh, repair as well. If you've got a chimney up there that uh, you're not sure if uh, is letting in the elements, they can help you there as well. Snow removal. And basically in the, the title of their company uh, is basically more, you guys do quite a bit. If somebody out there is not sure of all the services you provide, just can they just give you a call? Yep, just give us a call. Excellent. These guys will come on out. We're talking about uh, Google reviews out there of a 4.9. Um, you're going to see the people out there have been very happy with the work that they provided. They're able to take care of Parker, surrounding areas. Just give them a call. Once again, that is Integrity Solutions, located right here in Parker, Colorado. Reasonable, reliable, and done right. They do it right, or they won't do it at all. This is Gary Atencia with CNTV. And if you don't know, now you know.